This is another tutorial to show you how to use my um, placeholders to make your own album layout designs. Uh, the first thing you want to do is open from whichever album company you use. They should give you a template that shows you the guidelines. This one is from White House Custom Color. And instead of white, I'm going to fill it in with the color black. You could choose any color. <clears throat> There we go. Okay, so this is the fun part. <laughs> I can just drag the placeholders that I want. I'm going to choose the square one. I labeled them all. So I'm going to drag the square one up. And what you can see, it just copied it. It didn't take it away from my original file. Okay, so now that I have it here, I can do edit. Free transform, hold the shift key down, make it as large or small as I want. Or another thing I could do, let go of the shift key and move the mouse till I get these curved arrows and I could tip it. Okay, so it doesn't have to lay straight. Another thing I could do is uh, click this and drag it to make it a rectangle if I want to change it to a rectangle. I can make it any shape as wide as I want. Okay. So these are really basic shapes, and you can uh, warp them, resize, or move them, and you can also copy them and flip them. For example, I'm going to hit the return button to get the transformation lines off. I have this chosen, layer, duplicate layer, square copy, let's call it rectangle, tilt, hit OK, and then hit the move tool and then we're going to drag this over here and then we could just do edit transform rotate 180 whoops nope I meant to do edit <laughs> transform 90 and then we could also do edit free transform and just tilt it to go this way and I could shift and drag that in okay so for now, I'm just going to uh, right click and delete this layer because I was just showing you what you could do um, as far as uh, flipping the shapes and rotating them. And now I'm going to take the square again, drag it up and edit. Free transform, hold my shift key down, drag it, hit my return key, and then I could do edit, I'm sorry, layer, duplicate layer. Square copy, edit, our layer, <laughs> duplicate layer, square copy, move it again, and maybe I'll go up to my top square and move that. I'll just put them, uh, where's this one? There we go. Okay, and you could always do a uh, view show grid to make sure you have them evenly spaced and then another thing I can do let me get rid of the grid view show grid turn it off another thing I can do is take these three squares that I can see are right here left click on each while you hold the shift key down right click merge layers so now they're together so once I've evenly spaced them I could put them together I can also take those three edit transform rotate counterclockwise there and I have three vertical squares and now if I want to have let's say I want to have nine squares on this page I can just do layer duplicate layer and there's my three layer duplicate layer and then I have three more and then if I want I can select all nine of these and left click merge layers 